Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, we are going to see the constructions of unit exercise. Okay, so first problem. Construct triangle PQR with measurements PQ 5.8 cm, QR 6.5 cm and PR 4.5 cm. So here three sides are given. Okay, so this type of constructions we constructed in first exercise, right? Unit exercise is nothing but the revision of all the concepts which we have learned. So first, manam ila oka triangle aite draje sendi. So ila maniki three sides koda onna puru pillalu nimi kein chaptu na ante here second largest number ante renda va pedda number e daite undo dani ni base ka tis kali antu na. So first big number six point five, next five point eight. So dini manam base ka tis kuna. So write P. Q R. Okay. So P Q 5.8 centimeters. Q R 6.5 and P R 4.5 centimeters. So this is the rough sketch. Now take the scale and draw a line segment P Q of 5.8 centimeters. Okay. So place one point at zero. And another point at 5.8. This one. So now join these two points. So this is 5.8. So immediate ka manam name hai te ra se 5.8 centimeters. Now take the compass. So P nundi R ki distance and thaun nindi 4.5. So first we have to measure those distance. So 4 and 5 between fifth line is 4.5. So this is 4.5. So P nundi manam R ki oka road base se rand hinti ni kalpali. Okay. So draw an arc like this. Okay. With 4.5. Next Q nundi R ki. From Q to R how much distance? 6.5. So take the compass. And 6.5 between 6 and 7 fifth line on your scale. Just like this. Now place it on Q. Draw another arc. See these two arcs intersect at one point. Right. That point is the third vertex R. Now with the scale join QR and PR. Okay. So, after joining, the required triangle will be formed. Okay. So, this is the required triangle here. Steps of construction. First one, draw a rough sketch of a triangle and label it with the given measurements. Second one, draw a line segment with PQ is equals to 5.8 cm. Third one, draw an arc with center P and radius 4.5 cm. Fourth one, draw another arc with center Q and radius 6.5 cm to intersect the previous arc at R. Fifth one, join PR and QR. Thus, require the triangle PQR is constructed with the given measurements. Second one, Construct an isosceles triangle LMN with measurements LM equals to LN equal to 6.5 cm and MN equals to 8 cm. So here we have to construct an isosceles triangle. Okay. So isosceles triangle Rachayali Annapudu Rendu equal sides ni itu side una sides ka this is kunda. Base okati irundinti kakunda vere on the kada. So that is as base. So M N L M N eight centimeters and this is six point five centimeters and this is also six point five centimeters. Now take the scale and draw a line segment M N of eight centimeters at zero one point and at eight centimeters another point. Join these two points. Okay. So this is M and 
8 centimeters. Now M to L how much distance? 6.5. So take the scale with the compass measure 6.5 radius. This is. So with M as center draw an arc like this. Okay. And same N to L also 6.5. So again with same radius from N also draw another arc. Now the point of intersection of these two arcs is the third vertex L. Now just join these two points L and N, L and M also. So this is the required isosceles triangle here. Steps of construction. First one, draw a rough sketch of triangle and label it with given measurements. Second one, draw a line segment with MN is equals to 8 centimeters. Third one, draw an arc with center M and radius 6.5 centimeters. Fourth one, draw another arc with center N and same radius 6.5 to intersect the previous arc at L. Fifth one, join ML and NL. Hence, required triangle LMN is constructed with the given measurements. Third problem, construct triangle ABC with measurements angle A 60, angle B 70, AB equals to 7 cm. Here, two angles and one side is given. So, first write the given information and draw a triangle here so a b 7 centimeters so this is a b and this will be c a b 7 centimeters angle a 60 and angle b 70 degrees so this is a rough sketch now take the scale and draw a line segment of 7 centimeters at 0 1 point at 7 1 point now just join these two points okay so a b seven centimeters now now angle a 60 so place the protractor at a now take the down scale so this is 90 60 is less than so less than numbers small numbers always left side right so down scale so this is 60. Now just draw a ray. And this is 60 degrees. A x. Now what is angle B? Angle B 70 degrees. So it is 90. So left side 70. That means above scale. So place here. So draw another ray. Okay. Just extend this also. So this is X, this is Y and the point of intersection is C. Okay. So this is the required triangle ABC. Steps of construction. First one, draw a rough sketch of triangle and label it with given measurements. Second one, draw a line segment AB equals to 7 cm. Third one, Draw a ray AX such that angle BAX is equals to 60 degrees. Next one, draw another ray BY such that angle ABY is equals to 70 degrees. Next, name the intersecting point of AX and BY as C. Hence, required triangle ABC is constructed with the given measurements. Fourth problem here. Construct a right angle triangle XYZ in which angle Y 90, XY 5 cm, YZ 7 cm. So first draw a right angle triangle here. Okay. 
circle and x x y z x y 5 cm y z 7 cm and this is 90 degree otherwise like this also you can draw ma so y z also you can take as base and x y 5 cm now we will draw in this way okay so take the scale and draw a line segment of 5 cm so this is 5 cm x y 5 cm okay now 90 degrees just with the scale draw an arc like this okay so this will be 90 degrees so even if you check with protractor also this is 90 okay now Y Z how much seven centimeters. So with the scale, just measure seven centimeter radius. This is okay. So place it on Y and draw a ray. So the ray intersect at one point now. So that is Z. Now just join X Z. so this is the required triangle here steps of construction first one draw a rough sketch of triangle and label it with given measurements second one draw a line segment with xy is equals to 5 cm third one draw a ray yp such that angle xyp equals to 90 degrees fourth one draw an arc with center y and radius 7 cm to intersect yp at point z fifth one join x and z last one hence required triangle xyz is constructed with the given measurements fifth problem construct an equilateral triangle def in which de equals to ef equals to fd equals to 5 cm so here three sides are given write the given information and draw a triangle like this so label it d e f so all the three sides are 5 cm only right so this is the rough diagram now so first 5 cm so one point at 0 and another point at 5 now just join these two points so this is d e 5 cm now take the compass again this d f falls of 5 only na so just measure this distance 5 cm from d draw an arc and e to f distance also 5 cm so again from e draw another arc so now the point of intersection is f join ef and fd okay so this is the required triangle here d f steps of construction first one draw a rough sketch of the triangle and label it with the given measurements second one draw a line segment de of length 5 cm next third one draw an arc with the center d and radius 5 cm fourth one draw another arc with center e and same radius 5 cm to intersect the previous arc at f fifth one join df and ef last one thus the required triangle triangle def is constructed with the given measurements next problem sixth problem so construct a triangle with non included angle 
for the sides of ST and SU of length 6 and 7 cm respectively and angle T equals to 80 degrees. ST 6 cm, SU 7 cm, angle T 80 degrees. Okay. Now draw a line segment of 6 cm. So at 0 1 point, at 6 1 point, join these two points. So this is ST 6 cm. Now take the protractor and middle one 90. We want 80. So left side numbers. So here 80. Place one point and draw a ray through this point. Okay. So let it be X. Now take the compass yes, U 7 centimeters now. So measure 7 centimeters. Okay. So like this. Measure 7 centimeter and from yes draw an arc okay it intersect at one particular point now so that is u now just join this yes and u so this is the required triangle here s t u triangle steps of construction first one draw a rough sketch of triangle and label it with given measurements second one draw a line segment with ht equals to 6 cm third one draw a ray tx such that angle stx is equals to 80 degrees fourth one draw an arc with center s and radius 7 cm to intersect tx at point u Fifth one, join SU. Sixth one, hence required triangle, triangle STU is constructed with the given measurements. Next, the last problem of this chapter. Can you construct triangle DEF with DE 7 cm, EF 14 cm and FD 5 cm? If not, give reasons. So, a put in a question look. Can you construct if they ask you like this? Once, just check the sum of two sides. Okay. So, what is the rule? Sum of two sides must be greater than the third side. Okay. Sum of two sides must be greater than the third side. This is the rule here. So, here two sides. Here 7 cm one side, 14 cm and 5 cm. So, these are the sides of the triangle. So, if you sum this 7 plus 5 equals to 12, according to the rule, it must be greater than the third side. Right? So, but it is less than the third side. Right? So, we cannot construct a triangle here. So, just write like this given and no, we cannot construct a triangle. In a triangle, sum of two sides is always greater than the third side. But here, DE plus FD 7 plus 5 equals to 12. That is less than EF 14 centimeter. So, therefore, we cannot, with the given measurements, construction of triangle is not possible. Or we cannot construct a triangle also. You can write. Students, these are the problems in unit exercise. Students, please like this video and please share with your friends and please subscribe to my channel. So, my like chaydam valla video ane di inka chala mandi students ki reach out on di. Please like this video. Thank you for watching.